Good luck, everybody. The box break graded silver dollar shipwreck edition. Shipwreck coins. We're going to start off with our filler and see what happens seven times through. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is a race filler. We got racers. We got first and second place to award. And a little race action. Shuffle the name seven times. Three, four, five, six. Lucky number seven on your mark. Get set. Go. Ten seconds left. Andrew's up front. Five, four, three, two, one. It looks like Andrew and Michael W. would be my guess. There it is. Yes, Andrew and Michael W. Congratulations, wheels. Wheels and Andrew made it into the break for a lot cheaper than what it costs to get in there. So, add you guys to the list here. That concludes the filler part of our break. Thanks for getting in. Thanks for taking a shot in the filler if you didn't win. So, let's start, let's start randoming to see who is going to get which... Numbers. These are code numbers. Seven times through. Lucky number seven. Code numbers coming up. So let's get our numbers lined up right here beside the different uh, owner names. Let's start at the random here. Seven times through. Lucky number. Seven. All right, so you can see your number in this thing. It's a code number. So we'll be looking at the code as soon as I open this thing up. We'll see, you know, what the code number is, who the winner is.
it is it's just one number that you get and um it's the it's the number on the right side of the code so in the description uh there's a, there's a really good description and a picture showing the codes and stuff like that Good luck, everybody. What do we have here? Coming out of the box break. What is this? Ho! Oh, Shipwreck Certified Colonial 2R Casador. And the code, you can see, it has zero at the end. Zero for Zachary. Congratulations. This is going to be your hit. These are a little bit hard to focus. These are a little hard to focus. Sometimes you can get them dialed in and they'll look really good on the camera. Let me see. I'm just going to try just for a minute here to see what I can do with it. So yeah, so you can see some of the details on this and everything. It is a shipwreck coin. So that's that's just fantastic, man. Congratulations with your Spanish, I guess you would call it a debloom. I don't know if it would be called a debloom or not. It's a it's a colonial 2R. Sometimes you can see the date, and the date would actually be right here. Uh, sometimes on these, I'm able to spot that. I don't know if you can see it. But it, there's usually a date right there, like 17-something. You know, it may, the date may be on this side. I'm sorry. I, I don't see it, though. No, it's the date's not on this side. Heck, I don't know. A lot of these are from the 1700s. Anyway... So, yeah, we do these by code because they don't say the date on a lot of these. But sometimes you can figure it out. This shipwreck is a famous shipwreck. So you can see when that ship wrecked, and you'll know it's from that year. El Cazador is going to be what you would look up here. Genuine coin. Uh, El Cazador. So if you want to find out more about that shipwreck, I'm sure there's a whole story about it about that shipwreck and when that ship sunk when the treasure was found all that stuff so yeah those are those are really cool man really neat treasure item right there uh, congratulations again to zachary d who had the code number zero which is that that's how we award it so that was zero so anyway we got different things happening